Today we're going to look at the basic way to tree diagram a sentence. It's called a tree diagram because it looks like an inverted tree and the connecting lines look like branches coming from the main node. There are three basic parts to a sentence, the subject, verb, and the object. We will look at these basic forms today. Two basic, the two basic main parts of the tree diagram are the noun phrase and the verb phrase. In the basic noun phrase, there's a definite article, like the, or an indefinite article, like a or an. These can also be demonstrative and possessive pronouns, like my, your, ours. <clears throat> there can be an adjective that modifies the noun, and the central noun is also located in the noun phrase. A noun phrase example would be the red ball. The second basic part of the sentence is the verb phrase, which consists of a verb and possibly an adverb which modifies the verb. This is also where the direct object is located because as we remember the direct object receives the action of the verb. So let's try some tree diagrams for some practice. <clears throat> Here's our first sentence. The dog sat. If we wanted to diagram this sentence, we would start like this. At the top of our tree is our node for sentence. And we have the two parts. We have the noun phrase and we have the verb phrase. In the noun phrase, we have our definite article, the, and we have our central noun, dog. In our verb phrase, we only have the verb, set. So, the dog set. Okay, pretty simple. Let's move on to another sentence. In this example, we have the big cat jumped. So, let's diagram. We have our sentence, we have both parts, we have a noun phrase, and we have our verb phrase. Now, in our noun phrase, we, on, we also we have the definite article, and this time we have an adjective and the central noun. So we have the big cat, and we still only have just the verb in the verb phrase. The big cat jumped. In our third sentence, we have a girl ran quickly. So we have our sentence with our two parts with our noun phrase and our verb phrase. We have our basic noun phrase again this time with an indefinite article and our central noun. And in the verb phrase this time we have the verb and an adverb because the girl ran quickly. All right, let's try one more. In this sentence, we have the teacher gave a quiz. So we have all three basic parts of a sentence. We have our noun phrase and our verb phrase. In the noun phrase, we have our definite article, our central noun, our verb phrase, we have our verb, and also in the verb phrase we have another noun phrase because we have our direct object with an indefinite article and the central noun. So the teacher gave a quiz. And there's your basic lesson on how to diagram a basic tree diagram.